Breaking overnight, New Zealand officials say the gunman who opened fire at two mosques Friday, killing at least 50 people, may have had help. Two News' Kelly King is live now to walk us through the developments we're learning this morning. In a news conference today, New Zealand's police commissioner says Australian white supremacist Brenton Tarrant carried out the shootings alone. However, he added the suspect may have had support from other people, something they're heavily investigating. Tarrant was arrested moments after the shootings in Christchurch Friday. At least 50 people were killed and dozens more hurt. The 28-year-old is charged with murder and may face additional charges. Officials say Tarrant flew under the radar and wasn't on any type of watch list. Today, a Christchurch gun shop says it sold four guns and ammunition online to Tarrant. New Zealand officials say the shootings have raised questions about security. The threat level in New Zealand remains high. And you will continue to see for weeks to come high vigilance and high visibility from the New Zealand police and our emergency service partners. Terence says he wants to represent himself in court. Meanwhile, New Zealand's government says it's agreed on tougher gun laws for the country. Prime Minister says reforms will be announced within 10 days. Kelly King, 2 News Today, working for you.